Hello, Baby Bam Bam Pumpkin Hill. Now, lately I've had a lot of talk about Mormonism and the FLDS and the LDS, and then my affiliation with a group called the LOA. And so that's made a lot of people start to ask, what is the LOA and who are the LOA? I'm surprised that you say you're Mormon because you're involved with magic and you're a magician and involved with different forms of magic. And the LOA actually happens to be a mystical, magical Mormon group. We are the Latter-day Order of Amen. Amen is the true name of God in, and how it is pronounced in God's language. And the LOA actually believes that that people are put upon this earth and come upon this earth to establish their kingdom in heaven and their, their own planet and kingdoms in heaven and the hill after. And we're a hermetic organization, which means we're very highly secretive and, and we really don't talk too much about uh, our, our inner beliefs because it doesn't reflect what the LDS or any of those groups happen to, to say. Our prophet's name happens to be Barak Gazlam. L. And Bullock Gazlam L is also, it was, is in God's language. And it actually, it was the name that Joseph Smith himself went by. Sometimes he went by um, Gazlam, and sometimes he went by Bullock L. And it's actually the posi position of a prophet, and that's who our, our current prophet is. We are the guild of the first bone, and the boneless one. And we're laboring in the faculties of Abawak. Abawak is also known by certain words as Abba, Abba Sax, Abba Kadabba, comes from his name. Uh, Joseph Smith was involved with the faculties of Abawak and never, never disbanded that. We work with seal stones, and we work with peep stones, and we spy the peep stones. We actually use a momentello, we have a momentello. We work with both the lesser and the greater keys of Solomon. Some of you magicians might be familiar with those. We have different signs and tokens, um, penalties, handshakes, uh, blessings, anointings. Uh, we have priesthood powers. Uh, we have both. We have marriage, homosexual marriage for homosexuals. I think you people have heard in my other videos that the women in our organization actually have the greater priesthoods and the high priesthoods, the high priestesses. Uh, there's just all kinds of interesting things about our group. We can't really talk about it too much. If you want to go to YouTube forward slash, youtube.com forward slash Mormon Magic, that's M-O-R-M-O-N-M-A-G-I-C-K. There's some very interesting things there that will actually catapult you into the different ranks of the Latter-day Order of All Men. And they're actually initiation videos that you can watch, and they're designed to create a trans-hypnotic state and hypnotize you so that you will be able to excel into the different ranks and initiatory degrees of the LOA. You know, it used to be to become a 33-degree mason. It was a, it was a whole life endeavor, even to become a 32 Scottish white degree mason, it was a lifelong journey. Now you can do it in a weekend. Uh, the LDS actually show different videos. It used to be that when you went to have your anointings and blessings in the temple and to go through your endowment, that it was a whole big long rich ritual that would take all day long and there were actually people that would interact with different parts of the initiations and multiple people involved with it. Now a movie screen comes down, and you can just do it in the afternoon. They do all the initiations on a movie screen. And so the LOA has also now put up a fabulous site here on YouTube with videos that are just amazing. And they will take you through all the different degrees of glory in the d different kingdoms. And they will also, there's a whole, in, a whole endowment ritual that'll take you through the whole pretty much the whole endowment ceremony um, outside of like the very, very inner, inner degrees. So go ahead and check that out. Again, Mormon Magic, M-O-R-M-O-N-M-A-G-I-C-K. 
I highly recommend it. But we are an extremely liberal group. We are extremely liberal. We are modern Mormons. We believe in a, a modern prophet and in modern revolution, revelation. We also are goddess worshippers. We worship our Heavenly Mother almost more than our Heavenly Father. But actually, we, we believe that Elohim, like the Jews, our Heavenly Father is actually both our Heavenly Father and our Heavenly Mother. And it is a, it is a dual sexed Methodite God, which is true. Elohim, translated, actually means female plural and male singular for God and goddesses. Surprise! Um, but I know these things to be true. I know that Barak Gazlan El is a modern prophet of God. I believe that the latter day order of Amen, the guild of the first bone and the boneless one, is the path which I true to choose to hold on to. It's that iron rod of the straight and narrow that is a direct path to be the path that I have chosen. And I say these things solemnly in the name of Amen, Son Amen, Sons Amen, and Amen.